Young nigga, I turn nothing into something My hand was in that pot, I was tryna make something Oh yeah, these niggas be fake, so I'm watching these niggas Clutching my pistol, tryna slide on me, then I'm gon' kill him I'm not tryna kick it, niggas be fake What's good YouTube? It's your boy Generates coming at you guys with another video. Now if you're new to the channel, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and most importantly, hit the notification bell so you guys can get notified when I upload new videos. Now today, we got my guy Jonathan Isaac in here, bro. If y'all don't know who this guy is, he is a small forward that plays for the Orlando Magic in the NBA, the National Basketball Association, bro. This guy right here, he actually does have a lot of potential. He did do pretty well for them this year. They got to the playoffs got eliminated by the Raptors but they did steal the game so they have a lot of potential but as you can see his defense is what stands out the most he does have a 90 driving layup 85 open shot 3 95 dunk and contact 86 ball control so he can speed boost 610 speed booster 92 block 95 shot contest 92 steal what else it's, he has pretty good rebounding also for a small forward um 85 speed 80 speed of ball but i mean you're not gonna be like you're not gonna really be able to tell the difference of like speed between someone else that's faster than him so yeah he does move the court pretty quickly but the badges are what pop out to me a lot like four hall of fame badges for a ruby card hall of fame defensive pick dodger pickpocket and chase down and i also had to add a couple badges to him i'm i added deep range limitless relentless and yeah i think it was just three badges that i added to him oh and catch and shoot but he already had rim protector and posterizer so Yep, this is uh, Jonathan Isaac. We gonna get straight into the gameplay, bro. And we gonna see how good this card really is. All right, so y'all see, we got, we facing off against AI, James Harden, and Yao Ming. So this should be pretty easy. I'm not gonna lie, like, he can't really do much to me, but yeah, we gonna try to get Jonathan Isaac going really early. Now he is off balling. So we're gonna show y'all how to beat that real, real easily. Like, it's not hard to beat off ball. It's pretty easy. But yeah, we hit him with the crossover behind the back. My guy Jonathan Isaac to the rack. Oh my goodness. Yo, if y'all didn't know, this man has a 95 driving dunk and a 95 contact dunk. So he's literally going to be dunking everything. Like, Hall of Fame defensive stopper, pickpocket, rim protector. Well, he doesn't have rim protector Hall of Fame. He has it on gold. But you get the point. The guy's a lockdown guy, bro. But he's like, what? I don't understand how they didn't block that. But the fact that he's 6'10 and has a ball control of an 86 which goes to a 90 with my coach this is crazy like look what i'm doing to him right now oh yeah come here come here i'm gonna go right by you i'm gonna just go right by you for the layup it's too easy bro it's way too easy when you have a a small forward like that's what makes any card that's six nine and they have speed boosting and the ability to shoot it makes them really overpowered because like they're six nine so they're gonna get a lot of animations to do, like to go their way simply because they're height advantage over most players but did he really just make that bro whatever we got my boy jonathan isaac we're gonna try to heat up with him okay like i guarantee you that james harden steal rating is low maybe like an 80 but i don't know why they make like james harden tendency for stealing on ball should be like zero because he gets no steals on ball like he steals it from the lane and all that but yeah we're gonna post him up see if we get a post fade away oh so yeah that post fade away definitely is not where it's at it's definitely way too slow I thought it was going to be a lot quicker than that. But yeah, his post rate is way too slow. Bang! We going down in the um, transition. Getting a slam dunk with my guy, Jonathan Isaac. This card is OP. Now, um, I did put in an early clip, like, in the very beginning of the video. Because I was just a ridiculous three that I made from a different game. Like, from a different game I played with Jonathan Isaac. But yeah, back to this gameplay right here. We're going to try to get three off. Nope, got him. I don't know why he didn't dunk on AI, but... If AI is in that position again, next time he will get dunked on, bro. Guarantee it. But all we do... Ooh, he almost broke my ankles. As y'all see right there, the pickpocket Hall of Fame is activating, bro. Defensive stopper activating. He can't do nothing with James Harden right now. Like, he has no badges right now. Jonathan Isaac literally knocks it all down. I wish Bob Pettit had um, defensive stopper, but that would have been a, just a little bit too OP. But yeah, we're all up in his face right now. He can't do nothing. Look at this. We're clamping him up. He's taking a really bad contested three, and that's brick. If you would have made that, I would have quit. Now, let me say I wouldn't have quit, but oh, I wanted to dunk on him so bad, but 
James Harden was trailing me, and AI was like directly in front of me, but it's all good. My guy Jonathan Isaac, step back. Ooh, what you doing, boy? Going for the three, late release, open. That should have went in, bro. That definitely should have went in, but as y'all can see, he does have a quick release, so that should tell you how you should be releasing a jumper. A little bit quicker than usual, bro, because I, I was open on that shot. I just didn't make it, but um, yeah, to the rack with Jonathan Isaac. So that, that's the thing about this car, bro. He's a slasher. He can knock down a three at a high rate when he's wide open. Like this card is OP. This card is OP. Why, why did I not get that still? Oh my goodness. But as y'all see, I'm putting up the um scoreboard up the top right, right there. Um, Jonathan Isaac does have all the points, 10 points so far, but they're not really giving me too much on ball. So I don't want to sit here and just fuck. All right. So yeah, they're not really giving me too much steals, but he does have a 92 steal in a pickpocket hall of fame. So. I would think that I would at least get bailed for some of them, but they're not giving it to me. But it's all good, though. We're going to try to lock up on this Yao Ming. I know what he wants to do. He wants to go post. So I'm just going to, like, try to pull the chair on him a little bit. But, yeah, he's probably going to score. And, yeah, he ends up scoring. That Yao Ming is OP in the post, but he's just too slow. That's why I wouldn't recommend to use him unless you don't like unless you don't like to play fast pace but i do but i um, mean yeah, we're gonna go right by him and just lay that ball up it's just too easy bro i would like i said i wish he would have slam cammed it but we'll take the easy points regardless of the fact now do i wish that he had the lockdown badge i mean i mean i guess but at the same time he still does have his slashing badge so he's like a slashing lockdown and he still can make the three so it's still op at the end of the day bro i'm not complaining too much but um yeah, we basically have the lockdown badge right now. Cause when you get your takeover, ooh, please don't make that. Okay, but when you get your takeover, a lot of your stats does raise. So yeah, we're taking a three with Jonathan Isaac. That should be good, and it's water, bro. His release is so easy to green. Like I played with him yesterday in a play now game um, with my um cousin, and I was just greening everything. Like he did not miss a shot. It was ridiculous. But what the hell? All right, he made that. But yeah, for the people that say in play now is uh, cheese. It is cheese. It's like on rookie, but yeah, regardless of the fact, you still get to practice your shots, basically. But yeah, he's just an off baller, bro. Oh my god, he's probably gonna make that. All right, he misses that. We can test him. We're coming down the court. He's just anticipating me passing it to um Jonathan Isaac, but you can't stop him, bro. 95 driving dunk, 95 contact dunk. It's just too easy. It's just too damn easy, bro. He's coming down the court. Ooh, hit me with a nice move right there. I'm not going to lie. And he does knock that three down. It's all good. We're going to win this game regardless of the fact. So what I want to do, I want to try to get a three off with him, bro. But he's not really letting me. And we're going to take the three. Oh, my God. I wanted to do a step back. I wanted to do a step back. He's all over it, bro. Can we get some separation for a three-pointer? Step back. We're just going to go to the rack. Man, I wish he would have given me some separation for a three-pointer. I think we need to go for a three-pointer to end off the game, bro. This guy, this guy is just so bad, bro. I don't know who I'm playing right now. Exotic 153. I'm sorry, bro. You're just taking really bad shots. You need to learn how to play. But yeah, we're coming out of court with Jonathan Isaac. Hell no. Hell no. Don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. I want to get a screen and just come up the screen and just shoot the three. That's all I want to do. Run to three right there. Green light, bro. If you guys do not have this card, like, it does not matter what kind of team you have. This card can be in your team right now. Like, literally. I use them on my God Squad. And mind you, I have nothing but pink diamonds and a Galaxy Opal on my God Squad. And just Diamond Kirilenko, which is basically like a pink diamond because he has every single stat. Like, an 80 plus. But, yo, Jonathan Isaac, 22 points, 10 for 12, 2 for 3 for the three-point line this card is op like i don't know what else to say like and i sniped him for 1k for 1.6k but he is going for like 3k or something like that because like remember he has four hall of fame badges so it's not like this card is a slouch like look at his stats he has an 89 open shot three that gets boosted um his layup gets boosted to a 94 his dunk is a 95 like his ball control is a 90 this card is OP, bro. Like, seriously, he's literally OP. He's 6'10", 210 pounds, bro. 20 years old, four Hall of Fame badges, bro. Please get this card while you still can, bro. But, yo, that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Let me know what kind of videos you guys want to see in the future, and I will be sure to drop it. But, yeah, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, bro. That's pretty much it. If y'all enjoyed, let me know in the comment section down below.
It's your boy, JR Ranks. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'm out.